interesting. This goes to the rest of you. This goes You're gonna let the new girl walk in? You did the same thing with Paige today. And you're threatening to replace her with somebody else. Why do y'all keep saying replace? We, we're not coming to replace nobody. She just wants to be part of you. the team. But Thank when you, you refer to me or my child, it puts to you. me in the conversation. What did you say, Abby? I'm here sorry, here somebody was me. talking. You <laughs> was talking. I don't want to even use your name. That's why I keep saying her. I got a name I want to call you too and not your own, but I'm trying to be respectful. You just jump down on me like I'm trying to invade this scene and do something, and it's no liars. You're liars, especially you. Oh, yeah, okay. You are phony as hell. So are you. I'm not. You don't. You know what? what I see? I'm you, not you're phony fake. at all. Who I am is exactly who I come across as. Yeah, a bitch. That's what you are, and I know you own it. You don't know a thing, bitch. I'll be that bitch. Don't let the I door hit your ass on the way out. Pause. Now listen closely. gift for you guys. I have a fabulous, fun little thing to do. We took a bite out of Appy. Now we need to go enjoy our, our victory with them. I'll show you what I have. Oh. <laughs> Daddy, I can count on one hand how many times Mother's ever sucked in her life. Okay. I can't even believe you just did that. Go get her. Go get her. Oh, no, we gotta go? Go get her right now. Everyone knows this girl is a beautiful dancer, but what Abby said is horrible. Abby's just mad that we lost. They came in to rub it into our faces, and Abby let her have it. I didn't give it to your daughter. I did it to you. My daughter was in there and saw that. Don't look me up and down, you whore. Put in, take into account that this kid has feelings too, ever. Because everything out of your mouth is mean and hurtful. You're just jealous that Brynn has had a better season than Kendall. That's a flat out lie. You know what, why don't we just focus on the pyramid you'd moved on to this because this is not conducive to the girls. You're yes, the one who tears do. down kids every day. You guys make right. crap about my kid all the time. Uh, you're not out there, Kendall, so you don't know. Excuse me, Abby, I am not allowing this. It's running back to my tail right now. She can do this. Thank you. We'll do it. We'll get through it. Brynn is anxious about the duo. She is overwhelmed, and she's sad, and she's stressed, and she just is having a hard time coping with everything that's going on this week. I need to go to the bathroom for a second. Brynn? Make fun of me. Every opportunity hand it to you and then cry about it. They should just not do the duo then. Just be like, then you don't have a duo, that's fine. Yeah, if you don't like, you know what, how many times has Abby said, if you don't like it, don't do it. Don't do it. You're out. You, Done. Yeah. Now they're all practicing the group and she's not even in there practicing the group. This is the new beginning. You get to be a baby. That's I'm crying what about her duo. Is wrong. Like, that's what's not wrong. Fair. Come on. Hey, you guys know we're doing the group right now, right? Oh, All the other kids are in there doing the group? You're on the team, aren't you? The team's in there dancing. Why are you coming to her instead of Gianna? Because Gianna's working with the girls I know, and the boys. Why, why aren't you telling her Gianna everyone's in there? Why is this that? okay? I didn't know Why that? is she bowling and it's okay? Because she's beautiful and wonderful. It's going to be like her. <laughs> Kendall got her duo taken away because stop. she did that crap. No, I'm not going to stop. Go it's ridiculous. Kids are practicing their dance for you, for your play. name. Are you not ashamed of yourself? Yeah. yeah. That's a surprise me. So, what did you have to say about me? Nothing. I'm gonna give Talk this to you. Husbands. You talked about my husband? All of them. Really? 
So what the hell did you talk yeah, about? What did you talk about? She just asked about the husbands. First of all, you don't really even know my husband. Second, why aren't you telling her about your situation? Because you're the one in the middle of a divorce. Does she know you're separated? Yeah, I'm not talking about it, though. I don't understand why Melissa even brought that up. Oh, by the way, Kathy was asking about your husband. It just seemed weird. I really, we had a good time. It was nice. If you're going to gossip about anybody's home situation and their men, you need to talk about yourself. OK. You, yeah. Who had an affair with her boss who is living with a man who's still married? That's it. I did not have an affair with my boss. Yes, you did. No, I did not. Bitch. Relationship of Abby. Well, it doesn't matter what I say, so I'm just going to keep my mouth closed. Because that's what you always do. Yep. Unless you're I lying, don't. then you talk. You're so truthful all the time, Christy. I've had one husband. I haven't had two affairs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13. Things were going down. I see how your girls kind of get into that little clique and they exclude Nia. I don't think you see I that because you said once upon a time that used to be the case. Nia's that is what home. no, her, she, like, and she probably mm -hmm. is there. But I'm telling you what I saw. I hear them in there talking about me saying, well, she probably can't even afford to pay our tuition. She's a single mom with four kids. Things like that that I hear. Yes, that pushed me to that point.